All right, so we'll do a zero speed auto rotation this time. So we'll just get to altitude. We'll get a little bit more altitude this time. We're going to need it to pick that airspeed up. But what we're going to see happen is uh, as we lower the collective and roll that throttle off, the helicopter is going to obviously fall. But because the air holes on the tail, the nose is going to pitch down. So we're not going to have to be as aggressive with forward cyclic because it's essentially doing it for us in a zero speed auto rotation. Have anybody on the final on runway five? We're about 2100 or so. Right, Airspeed slowing. Just get to where we need to. Speed's about zero now. So in three, two, one. See that nose just fall. Rotor RPM looks good. That nose is going to fall pretty much by itself. And then I can just pitch as I need to for airspeed. And we can do that here. So we're at 1,700 feet. So let's slow the aircraft down. Let's get it all the way back down to zero. Look at the rotor RPM. A little bit light right now, but we still got plenty of rotor RPM. All right, now we're going to pitch over. Watch that RPM. Airspeed should come back up. There she is. All right, airspeed looks good. We're in trim. And we're going to start our flare. Alright, cross set T's and P's still look good, cross the warning lights are out, let's do it again.